So before I start this powerful video, I want you to hit that like button, which you are doing it for almost all my videos. Yes, guys. So what is the topic? Sir, so how to get rid of this exam fear, May 23 exam fear. All right. See, guys, if you talk about fear, let me tell you, there is no such thing called fear. It is just creation of your mind. Right, guys? And to tell you why this fear is happening. Why is it happening? It is happening because your exams are not yet over. You haven't completed your exams or you may be underprepared for your examination. That is why this exam fear thing is happening. Sir, now straight away come to the solution. I will tell you about this exam fear, how to tackle it or how to remove it from your brain but I will tell you it in a different way. All right. Yes, say that I am taking two examples. Maybe these examples are unrealistic but very much relevant for your passing or for understanding how to get rid of fear. Now listen, say if somebody is putting, you know, gun on your head, okay, and telling you, hey, hey you, complete your exam. Either you complete your exam or I suit you. Tell me one thing, honestly, okay. Will you think that after May, I've got November exams also. After May, I have option to give in November also. Will you have even a second thought? Will you take even a second opinion? Because the option is either you pass your exam or, or else I'll suit you. What, do you. what will you do? You will immediately, without giving a damn, that seven days or eight days left for the exam, or I have 1.5 day available for my study, you will straight away start giving your best, study non-stop without complaining. So I'm getting demotivated. So you know what? I've got less time. So this problem, so that problem, you won't give a damn. You'll straight away, you know, take out your material and start studying, start studying and go and write your paper completely, attempt full 100 marks and come and win. Why? I want to ask you why it happened. I'll tell you why. Let me come to some another example. Okay, another example. Say, say there is a guy called you know, Mr. Rohit. He's a CA finalist. Example. Okay, so his dream, one dream. Okay, his only dream was to complete CA before he dies. Okay, or he wants to complete CA, right? It was his childhood dream and he's struggling very hard for it, right? Example, okay, this is unrealistic data, but uh, you know, just to explain you, I am telling you, say doctor told ki, hey, Mr. Rohit, after few months, say after two, three months, you won't be anymore, okay? Just last three months are left, okay? And uh, after that, you won't be there anymore. It means you will die. Are you getting me? So, and... The most important thing in his life was to complete the degree. He is a CA finalist, was to complete CA. So tell me honestly, will that person even think that after May he's got option left in November? Tell me honestly, yeah. Tell me honestly. So the message is human being can achieve any damn thing, whether even if it is it seems it is impossible task. The human being can achieve it even in less time also provided there is urgency see in this case where the person was shooting him okay with the gun okay or he was about to die in few months okay in both case it is extremely urgent you pass or i suit you in this real unrealistic example i told you right so what you can what you can understand here when it is extremely urgent, okay, you are having no option left, yes, where it is extremely urgent to pass, even impossible task can be achieved. Even if less time is also there, it can be achieved. Right, guys? So, do not worry. Okay, find out your why. Find out if your why is strong enough and if that why is strong enough, there won't be any fear. There won't be anything that will be disturbing you, that will be diverting you. Understand very simple now in this case where, uh, you know, uh, 
uh, there is a gun on the head, you study or I suit you, you pass your exam or I suit you, suit you, then there is no other option. He will study, he won't complain that getting demotivated, not able to focus, uh, I am having less time, there won't be any complaint. Yes. So, the message is absolutely simple. If it is urgent for you, you won't complain. There won't be any fear. There won't be any disturbance. You will definitely and very easily crack this May 23 exams and that also without so-called fear. And this is what we try to do with our mentorship program student where till last day we support our students so that there is no question of fear till the last day they enter their exam hall. Right guys, if you are finding these videos to be very helpful for you, do subscribe the channel and share the link with your friends also. I am sure you must have given the like till now. Right guys, see you in the next video till then. Bye bye.